Hello, welcome to Lahi Labs, and this is a continuation of our series on setting up your own home lab where you can test some security skills and also gain those uh, well needed skills to actually work as a security analyst or a security professional. What you're looking at is my uh, current environment, it's a test environment where I've um, set up security onion with a Kibana elastic and log stash so they finally integrated those tools this is the lab that you'll be creating i'm running it in vmware esxi and today i'm going to show you how to create a port group that would allow you to send traffic from your network to this virtual machine uh, it's just sending a copy of that traffic from your network to the, this virtual machine so as you can see here uh, this is my um vCenter but you want to log into your VMware ESXi host and you want to make sure that uh, you go to the networking section at this point I'm going to assume uh, you know how to do this so we are going what we're going to do is we're going to add a virtual standard switch you can name it whatever you want or just let's call it a uh, mirror so it's very obvious. You want to make sure that uh, when you go in here, the mode is set to listen, and you want to set this to be promiscuous mode and hit add. So that's what you do. Once you have created your switch, uh, this is my current switch right now. As you can see, this is what the switch would look like. You are now have a virtual switch. The next thing that you want to do is if you go back to networking, you want to create a port group and this is uh, how you would actually assign these uh, virtual machines so in this port group I'll just call it mirror 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 group if I can type if you have any VLANs, this is where you specify the VLAN ID for the type of traffic that you're getting. Make sure you connect it to the same switch that you had created. So if I had created a mirror switch, make sure that you connect to that switch. And make sure that you also select security. You can leave it as an inherit from vSwitch. If your vSwitch is set to promiscuous mode, promiscuous mode. but I'll just make sure that I select promiscuous and hit add that's all you need to change and that's uh, what I have here so once you have your virtual switch called mirror switch and your port group connected to that virtual switch you should be able to click on the switch and look at what it looks like and as you can see we have uh, the switch is connected to physical adapter VMNIC3, that's a, an adapter on my uh, host. That's very important because this port is what you need to connect uh, to the other port on the switch that you are mirroring traffic to VMware ESXi. So once you have um, it set up, go ahead and uh, create a VM security onion and assign it here, as you can see. In the next video, I'll be showing you step by step instructions on how to install security onion with a elastic as you can see this is uh, the VM I just called it sec for security onion then elk for the elastic stash so once this is set up the next thing that you want to do is make sure that you go to your physical switch be it a Cisco or whatever you have connect the mirrored uh, port from the switch to your VMware host and in this case to Nick number three. Once you connect that, go to the switch, and in my case, I'm using a D-Link switch. If I go to port monitor, port mirroring here. I let me. I just need to. Okay. <clears throat> oh. So if I go to secu security, uh, actually, standard configuration port mirroring 
as you can see, I'm already sending port number two. So this port number two is my uh, port that I'm mirroring. It's sending it to port number 10, as you can see here. And I'm setting traffic from both direction in and out of port two to port 10. And port 10 is what's connected to my VMware right here. It's connected to the physical host right here. I have a diagram that I can show you. <coughs> so right here, this is my one. One is connected to port number two. And this right here is connected to port number 10. So I'm mirroring traffic from in and out of here to port 10. So that when the traffic hits my LAN from the internet, I can mirror it and monitor it. When it comes from the LAN to the internet, I can mirror it and monitor it. And at the end of the day, uh, this is what it looks like. And the lab, if I can, we end up with a lot of information. Uh, So as you can see, I have real-time events coming in, and this is my uh, Kibana, and I can actually drill down and find out what exactly is going on in and out, what, what are the events, um, well, well, what, what are the threats that are coming and all that stuff. So this is what it looks like, and um, if I minimize this, you can see that I have other security onion tools as well that I can use. So uh, subscribe to this channel, I'll be posting more of these videos and let me know in the description below if there's anything that you uh, need help with setting up this uh, in your VMware, just let me know. Also uh, remember to subscribe because I'll be posting a step-by-step -step instructions on how to end up with a working environment, but also we'll end up with uh, some skills that most of these uh, employers are requiring nowadays was being a security professional you need to be able to actually spend some time investigating in your own lab understand how things are set up and all that so this is the lab that i have right now and if you follow with me you'll be able to set it up for yourself and we can all work on some skills at the end of the day we want to be able to get familiar with how do you look at your network events and how do you investigate? So just remember to subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video. We will be talking about a full installation from the ISO of our security onion with bro and also with the elk uh, combination. So subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.